If you're listening by way of live streaming, you can become a part of this ministry. Is it God's will that you should be a member here rather than somewhere else? Be a member here, blessed in the second coming, which is if that's God's will, then you can make that known. You can also give your tithes and offerings. You want to get out of debt? Want to buy beautiful automobiles, like I said, outside our church? The tithe and the offering. Give a tithe. Get 10% of everything you get to the Lord, and the Lord will finance everything else you need to do. Did you hear I said? Give 10% of every, everything that you earn to Almighty God and never change that. That's the law. You give 10% to everything that you need, to everything that you have, rather. To every time you get a paycheck for $1,000, give God 100 You get a paycheck pay, pay, pay for 2000 give God for 200 give God 200 and God will finance everything you need. A Sabbath, you know, the young man came the other day. He wanted to offer us money for this building. It's one of all your arms aren't broke. Wiggle your arm, man. It says, Sabbath, you were in that meeting. Wiggle your arm, homie. Make sure, it's, and y'all sitting up in that meeting, that man was offering us money, it wasn't easy. Oh, it does, okay, all right. But let me say something to you, Bennett. God will finance if we need $2 million, if we need $20 million. Let me tell you something. God will finance everything that we need to do. And there will be nothing that we need to do that God Almighty will not finance. We tithe and we give first fruit offerings. And God has promised to finance every car we buy to finance every building that we purchase, to finance every suit that I purchase, to finance everything, every biscuit that we purchase for food, every pencil that we purchase, every computer that we purchase. God has promised to finance it if we just bring the tithe. And he'll be responsible for the rest. And so people need to understand that process. God will take care of you. We're getting ready to buy that second vehicle, just like when we parked two of them out there, just like the one that's parked out there now, through the finances of Almighty God. And we're going to keep on buying. After a while, they're going to call this the black church, the black car church. Everybody drive black car. I might get a red one, though. What do y'all think? A dark blood red. Big old vehicle like that, right? Back here. Y'all hear her? Nice, she said. <laughs> Now, now I got to fight that already, so I should have kept my mouth shut. But I might get a blood red one, though. With a beige interior, how about that? Yes. But if we need $2 million Sabbath, understand something. And don't you ever forget it. You ever forget it. God will provide our needs according to his riches, and he got it going on. God will provide our needs according to his riches and glory in the Son, Christ Jesus. We need two million. We need 10 million. Whatever we need, God will provide because we bring the tithe and the offering. We're not at the mercy of some bank. We're not at the mercy of family and friends. We're not at the mercy of nobody. God will supply our needs. According to the riches and glory in Christ Jesus. So, there you go. Tithe and the offering. Praise Almighty God.